Hey guys, so for today's video it's going to be a little bit short. Um, I wanted to do another unboxing which is like the third time that I'm doing this for school but I know that a lot of you guys had asked me to do this and I wanted to sort of separate the videos that way it wasn't just one after another after another. That way for people who didn't care so much about it they wouldn't be totally bored by my videos. So I'm just going to show you the makeup that we got at school. Um, I have like mixed feelings about, oh the lighting is starting to change. Okay, um, I have like mixed feelings about the makeup in general, but we're going to go through it all and I'm going to explain to you what I got, whatever. So, here we go. Everything is by Paint Cosmetics, or Paint Cosmetics is the one who provides us with everything, but there are other brands in there, so we'll get to that. So, it comes in this like tote bag thing. When you pull out the box, the box is like this, which is really nice actually for traveling, like when you're, when you're doing people's makeup, sorry, it's like... A little um a little dusty there <laughs> um it's nicer when you're traveling you know you just you kind of have everything compact in here so you open this up and then you have like two draws so uh yes i say draws like draws i know some people are gonna be like why do you say it like that but it's a new york thing so i don't know what other way to pronounce it so anyway the top draw um i will pull out it comes with this plastic covering and then it comes with all of these powders. So these powders I am obsessed with. I think they're great. Um, they come, mm, if I could take the plastic coating off. I'm struggling right now. So it comes with a bunch of different shadows over here and then it comes with the blushes, um, the bronzers, the powders, the highlighters, and the translucent powders. I love every one of these. I think that they're buildable. They're not too, um, how do you say it? Like, like, you know, when you like just put something right on your eye and it's like, okay, or like overpowering. And then you have like a difficult time blending it. Like it can go on softly and you can build upon it and you can blend it. So I think the powders are absolutely great and I love them so much. So I'm really happy with that. Then for the second drawer, um, one of the sponges just popped out. It actually comes with two, but I already used one. Um, let me see if I can somehow like lean this over without whatever. This is what it, this is what it comes with. Okay, so these are all a bunch of liquid foundations. It says super active liquid makeup, hypoallergenic. I do not like the foundations at all whatsoever. I find that they are a little bit flaky. The coverage is not good. Um, I hate to say that like I feel like so mean saying that but I just I really don't like them and the color options are so like look at the color options come on don't they all look exactly the same like you can't even really decipher what to use on whose face um, the ingredients aren't anything special obviously it's nothing I would use on my skin for sure you guys already know that I'm really picky about the foundations I put on my skin um, I just don't find that they do the job of what a foundation should do, so I don't really like these. I think that if you're going to take makeup seriously, you are better off buying a whole different set for foundations. Let's see what else. In here they have a bunch of like mascara spoolies, so that way you don't have to dip, you know, double dip in the same mascara thing, so that's nice. It comes with a sharpener, it comes with two sponges, one in which I already used. This, um, my nails are still like a little wet. I just painted them a little while ago. Um, let's see. It has a brown gel eyeliner. I love it. Um, this shimmer lip pencil. It says that it's a shimmer lip pencil. It's not shimmery at all. I actually find it to be quite matte. Um, it's in the color natural. This is the only lip liner it comes with. I think that this is one of the most beautiful lip liners I have ever used in my life. I am obsessed with it and when I run out I'm going to freak out because I need to get another one like ASAP. Um, this is a another gel eyeliner in the color noir so it's just you just have your brown and you have your black. This is the mascara it comes with. I find that I don't use black mascara period. I just find that it's like it makes me look crazy because like when I'm doing my own makeup it just it just makes me look crazy because I'm so pale and I got the red hair and then like the light eyes and it just like it's too too much but for other people it's nice um, it does take a little bit um, to dry so you want to make sure that you're not like you know blinking your eyes too much otherwise you're gonna get that 
you know when your like mascara like gets on top of your like brow bone and stuff because it's still wet don't do that um, but yeah other than that these are awesome then you have your regular concealers so these are just just your regular three colors you can you know sort of like color correct or whatever but you really have your color corrections in here they have orange green and purple so these are really nice um, I find that they can be a little bit a little bit streaky but if you apply them the right way and if you just work with them they are able to be worked with and they do last so um, I do like these I'm not obsessed with them but I do like them and I will definitely be using them this is just a, a cream well, cream eyeliner, gel eyeliner, whatever you want to call it. They call it a cream eyeliner. I guess it is more creamy. Um, I haven't used it yet because I just haven't had the need to. Um, I don't use it on myself and I haven't had a client yet who prefers this. So we will see how that works. And then this is the same thing in the color Onyx. So this is just a like, I think that this one is a little bit darker if I'm correct. I'm not 100% sure. But they're both like gel liners, just be whatever. But the packaging is really nice and it, it's like glass. So um, yeah, I don't know. I really like the packaging. You also have your shadow base. Um, this I have not even tried yet because I still use my personal like other bases and stuff like that. Like I use my Urban Decay Primer Potion if I need to or any other primers and things like that so I haven't tried that yet um, I hear that this is pretty good but I just have yet to try it but this is what it comes with these are three different glosses I find that these are kind of like I haven't even opened them so I really can't even talk much about them but they're so shimmery and I'm like whenever I think of something like super shimmery especially for a gloss I just think like little kid little like maybe like six when you first get your first like thing from Toys R Us and it's like all this little makeup and you have your shimmery lipsticks with all the, like the micro glitter in it um that's how I feel and I'm sorry I keep looking into the viewfinder I'm trying to break that habit um yeah I will I'm, I'm sure I'll use it this color seems nice because this seems to have like the least amount of shimmer in it and it does seem like a color that I would personally use and can be used on quite a lot of people these two seem like they're gonna be a lot more sheer because of the fact that they are um, they are shimmery and sheen it has like more of a sheen to it so I think that this one is gonna be a little bit more matte and more opaque so there's that then we have four different lipsticks and the colors vary but barely but I do like the colors so we're gonna go through them um, this first one is called micro kiss I think it's a nice color can you see that yeah I think it's a nice color then you have this is probably my favorite um, micro tea berry so I think this one is like really nice I just love like the dark like the like the dark colors that are still nude I think those are just they're really trendy right now but I also think that they do give a little bit more of like a classic look so I think it's nice that these sets are coming with colors that are sticking with the trend then you have this one this red one is so beautiful like I can't even tell you and it works with everybody um, it doesn't have a blue undertone so you have to watch if you are somebody who doesn't have like the whitest teeth in the world um, you're probably gonna want to pass on this because if it doesn't have a blue undertone in a red lipstick then your teeth are going to look even more yellow so you just have to be careful with that but this one is called red carpet and i personally love it and i like that it's deeper it's not so like vibrant and then the last one is micro mocha rose i also think that this one is beautiful now like i said they're all like fairly similar in their own ways they do have a little bit of a shimmer but um i you know if you like shimmer you like shimmer and you can kind of work with it both ways you can you know put a like a liner on underneath and then put this over and it will kind of give it a matte look and if you want to add a gloss over it to make it a glossier look that's what you can do so you can work with the four of these really well I think that they're really nice and I like them so that's it for as far as what comes in the box then there's a few other things you have your two brow um, brow blenders there's dark taupe and then there's soft taupe um, the soft taupe is obviously for more of like blondes and um, oh that was the wrong side blondes and uh, I guess like redheads and stuff this is the one that I use, even though I find that this is still a little bit too dark for me. But then again, I'm one of those, like, every single dark color freaks me out kind of people. 
So um, these are really nice. I like them. Um, the reason why that they are not in here is because they don't actually fit in here, which is kind of annoying, but it all fits in the bag. So, you know, whatever you, you take what you can get. Then you have your two um, mineral liquid powder foundations. So these are supposed to be liquid to powder. These are extremely dark. So um, these will only work on people with darker skin. But I do like this consistency. I just wish that they came in lighter colors as well. I wish that they had like the broad spectrum across, you know, that way people like with my color skin can use this and not just people with darker color skin. Um, especially because even though I have those other foundations in here, I just, I'm just not a fan of them at all. Um, these are much nicer. I don't person, they're not my favorite, you know, even if I could still go and choose another foundation, I definitely would, but I would still use these on a client. Those ones I would not use on clients. So, um, they're nice for what they are, but they're just really dark. You can even use these if you want to like contour, if you need like a cream contour, but you have to be very careful because they are extremely dark. Then you have this Paint Cosmetics, um, this is a cream foundation palette. Um, it's okay. It's not like, I mean, the, the color range is nice. At least they give you like a little bit more of a color range. It's okay. It's a little streaky. Um, the coverage is kind of buildable. It's just not, it's just not up to par to like what we see in like drugstores and things like that. So I think that's why I'm just being so picky about the foundations, but, but you can work with them for sure. And the last thing, which is my absolute favorite thing that this comes with is my, the paint cosmetics, um, brushes now a lot of these brushes are not from paint cosmetics themselves they are actually from crownbrush.com and if you guys know me you guys know that i've been using crown brush brushes for years and my brushes last me literally forever like i never have to buy new brushes i absolutely love them they're so durable they work so well um i'm just really 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 obsessed with them so i think i believe they come with like 36 this is what it looks like is this 36 i have no idea um I'm not going to go into detail about every single one that they have. If you guys want, I could do a blog where I'll post the picture. Um, like, actually, I'll definitely do that. I'll, I'll do a blog where I'll post pictures of every little thing that they have, and that way you can see each brush individually. Um, but I'm telling you, these brushes are amazing. Um, I love Crown Brush, like I said, so you guys already know that. But, yeah, that's all that the makeup comes with as far as uh, school but if you are a student um, paint cosmetics does offer you like a student discount and stuff like that so you can actually go and get like more products that they have to offer or you can go to like Sally's or somewhere else or you can just you know go to Sephora and get whatever other makeup that you want to use but if you're if you're trying to become a makeup artist and be you know like have everything in every color you don't really want to like go somewhere to Sephora where you're gonna have to spend like a million dollars on like one thing and like each color that way you can match each client and stuff like that so that's really annoying but um but for what it is I really like it overall I like it except for those foundations those foundations just drive me absolutely insane um but yeah that's about it i hope you guys like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you guys didn't see my last video um check it out right here i did a um a breakup video just how to cope with a breakup um or at least a new perspective on a breakup not necessarily coping with it but a new perspective on breakup so if that's something that you're going through or your friends going through then please go check that out because I think it may help you and I think every other video I'm going to do a beauty video then I'm going to do a talking video and I hope you guys are okay with that so yeah that's about it and I will see you guys in my next video bye